Hey guys, what's going on and welcome or welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I am going to be doing a lip swatch and a review of the Mars Cosmetics Double Trouble Lip Crayons. Now they offer a total of 12 lip crayons and that is equivalent 24 shades and I have with me is 5 lip crayons. So as always, you can check the description box below to see the shade names and for foundation shade reference, I'm NC40 in MAC and in Maybelline 310 Sun Beige. So if you have not already, then do not forget to hit the subscribe button and the bell icon right next to it so you're notified whenever I upload and now let's jump right in the video let's quickly go over with the features of these lip crayons now it says that this lip crayon is naughty and nice sweet and spice and everything that we would need to stir the trouble two beautiful shades to flaunt your two extreme personalities now it comes in a retractable packaging it is transfer proof and smudge proof it lasts up to five to seven hours now like i mentioned before they offer a total of 12 lip crayons which is equivalent to 24 shades and these are priced at 350 rupees for four grams of product which means it, there is two grams of product for each shade so this is how the packaging looks like the cap is color coordinated and you have the shade name and number mentioned as well and since these are retractable this is how the actual lip crayons look like and now let's finally move on to the lip swatches
All right, so let's quickly go over with the formula, the pros and the cons. Now, firstly, these are very pigmented. So one swipe, you get the full pigmentation. And these glide on very soft and smooth on the lips. And at the same time, it's very light and comfortable as well. Like it does not feel like you're wearing any lipstick at all. These lip crayons are quick drying and it settles into a matte finish. And these are transit proof and smudge proof as well, for example. There is zero transfer. Now for the longevity of these lip crayons, it lasted on me for like about five to six hours approximately and then I had to eat. And this is how it looks like once I had a heavy meal. As you guys can see, the outer line is left and once I press my lips together, it actually gives a very decent coverage of the original color. Oh, I forgot to mention that these are dual ended. So like you get two shades in one packaging. And lastly, for the removal of these lip crayons, you will have to use an oil based product. Otherwise, there will be a lot of tugging and pulling to remove them off your lips. And now for the FII, there are two points. The first point is that there is a very, very slight fragrance to it. Like only if you put it this close to your nose is when you can smell it. Otherwise, you cannot smell the fragrance at all. And even during application, I cannot get any smell. The second point is that you will have to ensure that your lips are well prepped and moisturized. Otherwise, it will emphasize your chapped lips. And lastly, for the cons, there is just one point and that is to do with the formula. Now, these lip crayons, after a while, if you press your lips together, it becomes a great or powdery and the color actually does come off in a very patchy manner I will insert a video of what exactly I'm talking about now personally for me this is a con because subconsciously whenever I'm thinking or concentrating on something that I kind of end up rubbing my lips together and when I do that I do not prefer my lipstick to become patchy and grainy and powdery and fall on my chin area and everything so yeah. Oh, and there is one other point I would like to add to the con list and that is to do with no proper arm swatches that is available online for a consumer to refer and buy. So yeah, these were my thoughts on the Mars Cosmetics Double Trouble Lip Crayons and this finally wraps up today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it and if you did, then do not forget to hit the subscribe button and the bell icon right next to it so that you're notified whenever I upload as well as like the video and comment down below. If you have any questions or requests, I will try my best for you as well as follow me on my socials which now are on Instagram and Schneider on Twitter as well. So until next time, take care. Bye.